Hey guys, Ethos here. Let's talk about Valorant's worst addition to the game, Clove. First off, let's talk about Clove's kit. It's remarkably well balanced, offering controller players a bunch of different options to take calculated risks without jeopardizing their team by dying. Let's talk about the smokes. First off, they're pretty decent actually. They pop pretty fast just like Brim, so they're perfect for like quick execs, quick pops. They do disappear fast, but they also recharge fast too. Being able to smoke while dead makes this agent have a great skill ceiling for players who are smart and might teach people to finally think about maybe smoking the spike in retakes. Honestly, most times when you have the site, you guys should. But that's not what you guys are here for. Let's address the elephant in the room. The pronouns. If you clicked on this video expecting me to harp on about Clove's non-binary identity, well, you're wrong. The real issue here is that Clove has called forth some pretty unsavory parts of the Valorant community, and it's honestly pretty embarrassing. I genuinely did not realize how many incels there are in the Valorant community, especially comparing it to the more traditionally toxic communities like CS or League. I figured this wouldn't have posed as big of an issue when I first heard about it. Our general response to it has actually made me feel ashamed to be part of Valorant. I've seen some discussions that are more toxic than watching a female CS streamer play in Russia. Now, if you're a hater of Clove and their gender identity, just let me your ear for a couple minutes before you click off. I understand why some of you guys may be disturbed by the addition of Clove to the game. Some of you find it a hassle to learn their correct pronouns, while others are actually just straight up against the idea of non-binary representation in gaming. And I understand video games are, for a lot of people, a way to get away from the real world and real world topics, so why bring it into a video game? But let me just say one thing to you, and I mean this with all the love in my heart, but are you guys actually serious like honestly who cares why do you guys care so much i understand for some of you the idea is foreign and to me the lgbtq movement and non-binary has never been like a real huge factor in my life my circle of friends is pretty small and out of all the people i talk to the topic rarely gets introduced so it's not a big part of my life but it's also never really bothered me and if you are truly against the idea of a non-binary character in a video game just ask yourself this does it hurt you in any way and if so how does it hurt you? And why? I've seen some of the most illogical arguments ever made, but I don't know. Hey, it's the internet. I guess it makes sense. Now on to the arguments. Why should I care? Well, perhaps you shouldn't, because Riot didn't introduce Clove for you. It's about creating a more inclusive environment for those who do care. Let's face it, gaming should be a safe space for everyone, regardless of gender identity. Like most hobbies, the only impact this should have on the game is making more minority groups feel more comfortable playing this game. And the more inclusive this game becomes, the more those types of people may feel comfortable to communicate. It's actually a big thing where women and other marginalized groups will feel scared to come in these games because they are worried they're going to get faced with sexism. I mean, I've heard plenty of horror stories from my friends, female streamers, where they'll just speak and they'll immediately get told to go back to the kitchen or just have teammates throw immediately. Like that just sounds like it sucks. Like imagine that if you just spoke and immediately you just lose. You can't even talk in this game. And that's how nervous you are. And that's how unsafe you feel playing a video game. And if anything, this should just make the quality of games better, honestly. Isn't that what we all want? To just have better games, to have a better experience playing this game? Women in gaming in general has always been a tough thing, especially in other titles like Counter-Strike, where sexism and the like run rampant, completely unpoliced. All Riot is trying to do is to create a space where everyone can be happy. And if you're thinking to yourself right now, well, what about my happiness? I'm upset about this addition, so they are making everyone happy. Well, then that means your happiness literally hinges on other people being unhappy. And at that point, I'm pleading you to look in the mirror and ask yourself, why do you need others to feel worse so you can feel better? The next argument I've heard is about adding confusing pronouns into callouts and how that'll affect gameplay. The example being, if someone were to calm their market, then it creates ambiguity as if to whether or not Clove is there or multiple people are there. And at first, it makes sense. I get it. They can be confusing. They are a market. They are here. They are there. It could sound like multiple people. It could sound like Clove. But if you're genuinely concerned about this aspect of the game, you aren't good enough at Valorant to be allowed to care about that kind of stuff. Just making an excuse now. Because I'll tell you, at the higher ranks, all the way up to pro play, even saying he's market or she's market is not an ideal comp to begin with. Valorant and other TAC FPSs hinge on clarity and efficiency, which is getting across the most important information as clear and as quickly as possible. The correct comp would be something like the agent or agent's names or the number of the agents, followed by the location and any damage done. Even better comms are followed by a clear instruction as to what you want your teammates to do with this information. For example, Clove Market, hit 80, take B, or 2 Market, only 1A, go A, or Sova Jet Market, etc, etc. So if you're genuinely concerned about this stuff, 
you to focus on improving your comms regardless of the agent's pronouns. Like if I heard my duo comming that he's at X or she's at X, I'm already flaming them for not having better comms. Just do better. I understand for a lot of you that this addition comes as an attack to your alpha, sigma, whatever the Greek letter followed by male mentality, because it may betray your own values and perspectives on the subject. But honestly, I don't even care what your values are and I don't care if you change them. But to act so grossly outwardly about it to others just comes off as pathetic. There's nothing alpha male or sigma about being threatened by other people feeling more comfortable in their own skin. Video games like most hobbies are meant for everyone to enjoy, so why not let everyone just enjoy it together. If anything, I think it's pretty beta to care so much about something that has no direct impact on your life or experience. If you're a true alpha or sigma or whatever the fuck, by definition, things like that should not bother you. Let people live their lives and don't act like some mindless incel drone and think for yourself for once. Whether or not this is something you actually need to care about. Stop listening to Andrew Tate before you queue rank. It's not helping. It's definitely not helping. Let's dispel this notion that strength lies in the resistance to change. That just makes no sense. In my opinion, true strength lies in the acceptance and empathy of others. So if you want to be a true Sigma, let's ditch that toxicity and embrace diversity. Because after all, gaming is for everyone and gatekeeping that doesn't make you cool at all. Enjoy the rest of the clips. Alive, oh my god, 130 to jump. They're just hitting all my trips. Nice, nice. Yellow. Yellow. Stop the eagle. Stop the eagle. Oh, shit. Backside, backside. Yep, backside. Is she wolf? Good point. Good point. Good point. Good flank, good flank, good flank. Hold down, good flank. Hold down, good flank. We have one smoke. Nice. Monster Bear too. Snow, 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 snow. Left side, snow. Nice jump. Good. Top man. That's the A guy. KJ and Snow. Let's go. And what? Oh, you close door. Ah, 70, 70 on. Fuck that, come on. Get him, girl! Oh, that's you. Nice! Split of it. I swear to God, this is crazy. Uh, I'm all thinking, fuck it. You guys need me. You guys need me, and I got this. Never mind, you guys don't need me. Wait, wait, I'm gonna die! No! Wait, defuse faster! Defuse faster! No, wait, don't get off! Faster! Defuse faster! I said faster! No! Stay around it! You're fine, you're fine. What do you mean I'm fine? I'm literally dead.